Hello everyone, we're back with more Southern Fried Grooves, Elden Ring, Seamless Co-op Edition. This is a really long fucking title. Uh, if I sound weird, it's because I have the vid, uh, but I'm mostly alive for the most part. I can't confirm or deny if I'm on a stretcher right now, um, but other than that, all is well. Fabian's here. He doesn't have the vid. Um, Fabian, hello. Hi. going i have no idea we're going to morn castle we already knew where we were going it was just more of a question for the audience than anything else also we can get on horses oh channel your inner sleepy joe i am channeling my cucumber joe right now uh shout out to cucumber joe from cold ones uh, again cold ones we are indeed open uh so yeah we hope you're all enjoying uh this wonderful little neat little series we have here uh it seems like you are uh holy shit uh, so thank you for that. Big, big McThankies um, from McSpankies. And again, apologies that I sound like I am uh, talking through a trumpet at all times of the video. Hopefully you'll find it in your uh, sweet little hearts to forgive me. Um, ugh, good God. Should have got the fourth vaccine, idiot. I, I should have got the fourth vaccine, honestly. I don't know what... Can you do that? Yeah, you can jump down on the... Oh, God. Air tunnels. Look at this scrub... Oh, you can. Okay, great. Uh, look, I might have missed it. You're embarrassing. I can't <laughs> take you anywhere. <laughs> look, this is supposed to be a gameplay. Uh, yeah, this is a walkthrough, answer. actually. Uh huh. Yeah, seamless co-op walkthrough. This coffee's so fucking good, bro. I don't even care if it's Folgers. I don't care if it's McDonald's. If it's coffee, I want it inside me. It's mm, mm. It's perfect. I feel like the only difference between, uh, you know, you know, how I feel like people from the 1950s drank more coffee than us. Uh, the only difference between then uh, and now is they beat their wives more frequently. Would you agree or disagree? <laughs> well, you raised multiple points there. <laughs> <laughs> oh, fuck. Uh, I definitely think I drink more coffee than any person ever in history. Now, uh, how many cups of coffee do you drink a day and how many times do you shit a day in correlation to said coffee? <clears throat> I probably have like one poop caused by the coffee, but I drink <laughs> on a normal day at work probably about eight cups of coffee, and that's two shots of espresso each cup. Jesus. So a lot, a lot of coffee. That is a lot of coffee. I think if you gave that to a man from the 1950s now, um, he would die. Multiple wives. Uh, <laughs> we're starting off strong here on whatever fucking episode this is. Mike, how are you? We haven't asked in a little while. How 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 are things? How How's are the, the wife, the kids, <laughs> the non-existent? Uh, hopefully, you eventually have a dog. Uh, this is the film <laughs> make sad, make Mike sad portion of the uh, Dark Souls podcast. Al, look, we just we, we we don't have as many Mike portions. We 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 need another Mike portion. In fact, uh, you know what? No, I'm not going to do that because the last thing this man wants to do is edit the shit out of a Southern Fried Groove episode, and I don't blame him when it's just majority shit post. Hello, Castle Morn. What are you going on about? Bro, I don't know. I'm fucking... What is, what is a mic portion? I, a mic portion? Uh, what is a mic portion? Mike, how much food do you eat at dinner? Um, it's a microdose. It's a... <laughs> that was a terrible joke, Fabian. I'm fucking disappointed in you. I need to... <laughs> This is the uh, hostile episode of the Southern Fried Groups. Uh, fuck, why did I shatter that rune? Actually, hold on. One sec I'm going to level up. I I'm able to level, I think. I'll be up here I playing the game. I I well, I'm going to be down here doing important... All right, look. Hostile level. Don't don't worry about it. <laughs> <laughs> we'll talk about this At off air. The post okay, okay. Yeah, that's fair. Okay, every enemy in this courtyard just disappeared oh so they're all just oh because i sat down at <laughs> oh and they've all just reappeared because <laughs> i sat down i have the power to control uh countless things all right where's i like how i just have moonvale um <laughs> it's fucking great all right they're all about to vanish again by the way uh <laughs> what 
I'm gonna run out of Estus because of you. All that for one intelligent point, by the way. <laughs> I still got ten more to go till I can even use Moonveil. <laughs> It's like a mid to late game weapon, and here I am, early game. Me use Moonveil off of one you got from whatever the fuck that was. Yeah, that was still the most random thing to happen so far. That was fucking ridiculous. I, I fucking can't with that shit. Oh my god. Florida water is so bad, but goddamn, it's still refreshing. Yeah, you know you're truly, like, brainwashed whenever you start saying Florida water is good. It, it gets the job done. I'm not saying it's good. I'm saying it. Yeah, good. What the fuck? My man is in the air. Ooh, that brother's floating. Oh, there he goes. Ow. You've just summoned the whole of the world uh, over here, haven't you, big boy? Funnily enough. Damn, what the fuck is oh. that delay? Holy shit. Bro has the swing time of the length of the Civil War. I don't know what that means. Oh my god. And it does an AoE. Yeah, we're getting um butt Ooh. fucked. Ooh. Ooh. Wait. Am I just gonna go straight to respawning? Oh yeah, I guess you just I'm respawn. just gonna come back oh, down right. and uh Cause I might as well just go ahead and refill the old Estus and we'll redo this. Do you want to? Not not yeah. the recording, of course, but uh <clears throat> Delete it all. Erase the Facebook channel. Erase the Facebook and channel. And the YouTube. Bro, I just recently did a Facebook friend purge. There were people on there. Like, what the fuck? How did they even get onto my friends list? The, it, you know, those like drunk sessions of Facebook where you're like, you know what? I'm going to add you as a friend so I can look at your posts. I was friends with Malfury and Stormrage. Oh, that's a interesting. <laughs> person to be friend was on Facebook. <laughs> so confused. I went to his page and all that was left was like from 2013 posts like I took his castle. Apparently Malfurion's big into mobile gaming. Uh, <laughs> big big Diablo Immortal fan, that guy. I'm really feeling for him, honestly. Him and Taronda not doing too hot, I, I guess. Uh, he, when you turn to Diablo Immortal and he spent their entire bank account on a uh, the uh, eternal orbs it really started to go south by the way fuck diablo immortal what a goddamn travesty now Furion seemed like the type of guy to have a hot mail <laughs> <laughs> fucking hot mail who what that oops so in my business i'm in you'll occasionally get like boomers with some old ass emails nothing really makes it feel old when someone rolls in with a netgear email Netgear. I don't even know if it still works. I've had one person give me a Netgear email, and I was the most confused I have ever been. Like my brother. I had Netgear before I started playing WoW, and that was in 08. I can date a lot of things via WoW. Oh, shit. Got his ass. That was dope. It's like the Mayan calendar, but with uh, expansions. All right. I probably better not use all my... I'm scared. Oh god. Oh god. Baby, I'm scared. Oh, he's he's angry too. We're getting fucked. Oh my god. I know. Okay, goodbye. Okay, he's he should be dead. Oh my god. I feel like it's I feel like it's bugging a little bit today. Am I crazy? No, just a little, you know, a little laggy. <laughs> <coughs> oh god, I'm dying. Uh, we are finding the seams. We are, yep. Uh, seamless. Mm, mm, mm. Nope. Uh, this is a zipper. Seamstress. Oh my god. Okay. Beat him up for living in a castle. What? How is he not dead? He literally attacked him. Hey, it's a pumpkin head. Hey, it's seamless, by the way. Oh, pumpkin head. I'm gonna put a seam in his butt. Oh my god. He's really cute though. Uh oh. No, no, no. What? No. Did that arrow hit his helmet and negate 100% of the oh, damage? Oh, Jesus. He just hit me dead on with his big ass fucking pumpkin. Ow. My got pumpkin. <laughs> you got pumpkin. Okay, oh, so. Oh my god. Whenever you kill them, just know they have a little bit of life after death. I'm yeah, not sure. I've been, I've been noticing they get another swing off. <laughs> I'm not sure what prophecy that's supposed to tell, but uh, that sounded extra deep, so I'm just going to roll with it. Time after time, 
What when you fall, I will catch you. Bro, weren't the 80s kind of cracked? I mean, I wasn't alive during the 80s. There was a lot of crack. I was, that's very true. Yeah. It probably explains the music, too. I mean, I was in my dad's balls, so. Uh-huh. Actually, I probably uh -huh. wasn't even in the, I mean, we produced so much goddamn sperm on There's no shot I was in my dad's balls, actually. <laughs> no shot. <sighs> Ow. That actually reminds me. You remember how strange our sexual education was in fucking middle school? Mm. It was... So, we I'm not going to obviously dox us, but... I'm assuming we went through the same thing where instead of telling us, hey, this is how you put on a condom and this is how you have safe sex, they were like, don't have sex, you will fucking die. Here's pictures of a wiener with warts all over it. Uh-oh. <laughs> I just fell to my death with this uh, with this lad. Yeah. But yeah, that uh, that happened. <laughs> How you gonna get up? I gotta run back up. <sighs> Fuck me. Is that to say I'm pretty sure you can, as long as we're not in a boss fight. Boss weapons. <sighs> Castle Morn, known for its high walls. Uh, they are rather high. Also, how bad is the rot increase? Is it that fucking bad? Uh, I mean, you can read the stat if you go to your uh, oh, items. That's, that's It'll right. should be like the second menu. It'll tell you what the reduction is. I forgot. There's items, and you have to read in this game. This game makes me read. Not a that's fan. That's why I'm playing a sorcerer. Oh, mother... That's a... Angry demi human. How are things going up there for you? I'm getting attacked by I, the natives. You, you should, <laughs> back to the natives again. Okay, well that's uh, that's good. <clears throat> Hope there's there's a actually a quest where you can. Uh, there's a guy that wants to befriend the demi humans because mm. they mm. are. Because under the Erd tree, all life is sacred. Ah, yes, of course. But he really just wants to use them as servants. Ah, still. okay. Back to back to the Catholics. We we're getting full circle on a lot of these conversations. We've gone from Catholicism oh to oh fuck. Okay, hold on. I gotta get my soulsy woolsies. Um, or whatever the fuck. I don't think anyone has ever called them runes. I keep forgetting they're actually called runes. And to be fair, me too. I. Damn. Hey there. Hi. Hey there. After playing Bloodborne for a bit and then coming back to this, it's like, I don't even know. It's, it's rough. What? It's, this is rough? Oh, no. This, just the, the changes. Because, like, Bloodborne's still faster, I think. Yeah. But I don't know. It feels so fucking different. Bloodborne is significantly different. Yeah, it's... I would say faster, yes. <sighs> Except for that frame rate. Hey. Oh, hey! Oh my God, it's uh, so bad. Unbearable. I, I started. Uh, I mean, I got, you get semi used to it once you start play. Oh, fucking goddamn wooden sticks. Um, you get semi used to it, but then you're just like, ah, you hop on a game like this and it's buttery smooth. Like Paula Dean would even be jealous. Um, she has a smooth heart. I. <laughs> I don't know how much we want to talk about Paula Dean on the the Elden Ring podcast here. Get her on the podcast. <laughs> yeah, sure. Who's Paula Dean? Who's you don't know who Paula Dean is? <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> Fucking god damn it. I was like, bro, that reminds me of the time I uh went to um Savannah, Georgia with my uh, wonderful parents uh, and my sister. We went to Paula Dean's buffet and this is when I was a real big like fat fucking kid. Like I was husky times too. Uh, and she had this delicious, delicious mac and cheese. I mean, it was mm, scrump diddly umptious. Um, unfortunately, I thought it was so good. Uh, I ate heaping amounts of it, like enough to fit into my husky uh, two-size uh, jeans um, that made me look like I had the fattest ass in the South. Yeah. And you know what I did? You know what my fucking husky fat ass did? I said, what did you do? I said, uh-oh, I don't feel too good. I went to the bathroom. I threw it all up, and I said, mmm, yummy. And then I went back for seconds, or whatever they were <laughs> at that point. Paula Dean could not stop me herself. <laughs> that was, and I guarantee you, if I went back to it now, 
it would probably be the most subpar mac and cheese. Actually, it'd probably be all right. She makes some pretty good food. She may it's be racist, hard, but she makes some good food. Is she racist? I, I you know, she said the uh, N-word uh, once. So No, Paula. Paula. When that uh, when, I don't. I can't remember when that was. Uh she got Paula Dean. She got Paula Dean, the classic. Uh, Paula Dean said, "Don't ah, like the don't the say more. Don't say racial slurs challenge," and she lost. <laughs> uh, good job, Paula. Thanks. Uh, Come on, the, on, Paula. On the next episode of the Southern Fried Groups, we also played the "Don't Say Racial Slurs" challenge. <laughs> I promise we'll win. Oh fuck. <laughs>